the free books app is a app that you can use to download any books that are in the public domain. So if the book is no longer in copyright and is a free book, rather than paying for a lot of paper copies for your students, you can download it right to their mobile device. So in order to do it, it's very simple. You can go to the library and just kind of look through all the different ones. They have different categories. Or you can search. For instance, if you were looking for um, like a Jane Austen book, you could just put her name in and do a search. So you can see all the different books that they have on Jane Austen. If there's one that you want to get, like Mansfield Park, you can just tap on it and then say download it. There are ads in this because okay, it is a free app. How many calories in a cheeseburger? I'll go ahead and turn that sound off. But since this is primarily for your upper age students, you can actually explain to them how to avoid apps. So I'll go ahead and X out of there. And now you'll see that I'm in my library and it shows you the books that I have downloaded into my library. You can then tap on it and you can read it just like you would with a Kindle app or anything like that. The other nice thing about this is you can annotate it just like you would with a Kindle app. Um, you can change kind of the different themes. You can highlight different sections and maybe write a note on it. So there's a lot of different things that you can do with this app that you know may just save you some money if you're reading some of the classics a lot of those are in the public domain and it just makes it a little bit easier you can see here on the top left there's also an option to get some audiobooks if you're willing to pay the $3.99 so if you have students who maybe have a tough time reading but they have a night they can handle listening to full books that audiobook option might be a good choice for you